Republican incumbent Phil Scott and Democratic challenger Christine Hallquist squaring off for the second time in a debate, this time in front of hundreds of voters at the Paramount Theater in Rutland, listening to each major party candidate give their views on a number of issues from health care to school consolidation, even internet connectivity. I'm being denied those rights Thank you very much. by those two candidates. Gubernatorial candidate Charles Laramie interrupting the start of the debate. He's one of several candidates also on the ballot disappointed they weren't included on stage. The historic nature of Christine Halquist running uh, for governor as a, as a major party candidate, first uh, out transgender candidate in the country, uh, but also we're really interested in Phil Scott. Anthony Zucker is a reporter with the BBC based in Washington, D.C. He and his colleague were here for Tuesday's debate. There's a lot of interest in the U.K. on the gun issue uh, and why it's such a hard issue uh, in the United States to deal with. Governor Scott's gun legislation got their attention. Brits and the world look and, and see examples of gun violence and they wonder why Americans don't do more. Uh, and here's an example of a state where someone did try to do more and paid a political price for it. So they find that fascinating. Burlington Independent filmmaker Paul Rosenfield has been following the campaign. He's making a film for the British-based newspaper, The Guardian. Both will follow the race up to Election Day. It's a, a notable race uh, and, and one that, that it deserves an international focus. In Rutland, Matt Layton, NBC5 News.